And I remember thinking, I'm about to beat this bitch up. We interrupt this program for an important news announcement. Today we are back, biggity back, biggity back, biggity back. I need to slow it down, slow it down. This video is sponsored by Shein. They have decided to send over not one, but two wigs. I'm so excited to get into this review slash try-ons. I got a braided wig and I got another wig that's kind of wavy. The gag is they're both synthetic. We're gonna see if it's a hit or miss today because we all know synthetic wigs can be a hit or miss, but you don't sleep on them either way. Okay, as always, without further ado, let's get into the review. Boom! So these are the two wigs, and I don't know which one to try first. Actually, I do. The first wig is a wavy black wig. Let me see the details. Um, I can't think of the details off the top of my head, but I do know that she's 30 inches. The link will also be in the description for this hair. This wig actually feels relatively lightweight in the bag, like light as a feather. I don't really know what to say about that, y'all. The last thing we want is a thin wig. Let's go ahead and try her on. Ah! Hold on, y'all. I also have to record for my TikTok. <laughs> so we have netting for her to protect the curls. She is so cute. I have a really good feeling about this wig. This is the lace. She comes with one, two, three combs if you would like a flatter install i would recommend cutting those combs out i won't be doing that because i don't really have time to but that's okay taking my cream foundation i'm going to be applying this to the inside of the lace i'm just going to take these back clips right here and i'm going to clip them together Okay, she's she's giving. If someone was to give me this wig and tell me, hey, guess if this wig is synthetic or human hair, I honestly wouldn't know. This is how the lace is looking. So she's not plucked. And will I be plucking her? No, but it looks okay. I did not cut the lace yet, and it's still, it's blending in pretty seamlessly. Let me zoom out so you guys can really get into this. <laughs> how she looks this is the back you know how there's some people you could just tell like oh she's beautiful or yeah she's fine from the back of their head i feel like this is one of those wigs or like this is that hair type that's like oh yeah she's fine because if you wear this hair you're gonna feel like a baddie for real tell me i'm lying i'm not you gotta get it for yourself and see ah, 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 stiff wear all right so now that you guys have an idea of how the hair looks down i'm gonna take my mousse a lot of body mousse, which I am absolutely in love with this. Speaking of which, a lot of body, if you see this video, if you see this video like I see you, sponsor me. I'm gonna take this and I'm just gonna brush the hair back. Catch me in the whip, ride with her. Hey, sipping something, bumping big, hypnotized with her. Pray you get that job in town, bro. That's only four hours. After I'm done with that, all I'm gonna do is just clip my hair back. Now that I put the hair back, I'm gonna put the clips in my hair so that I could cut the lace off, and then we'll get into edges. I'm just gonna be going in with some got to be. And we're gonna do our edges real quick. So now we will be back with the final result for this hair in three, two, one. Boom! We're back. I love this hair. I love how this look came out. See, I sometimes forget how much I really love these all black looks. And I know very few of you are like, oh, she's sponsored by Shein. Of course she's gonna say good things about the video. Blah, blah, blah. You can't tell me this hair is not eating the girls up. What I will say though, is I wish that the lace was a little better, like that the hair was plucked. If the hairline was plucked, she would eat the girls up. 
You work at clothes, you in dental school. A little tip for you guys if your hair tangles a lot, which is very common with synthetic wigs. Take my mousse and I'll put some on a brush like this. Putting you guys on. And I just brush through it. Hold the top just to make sure that it doesn't come out. And just brush through it like that. It's like literally just gliding through the hair now. Just got this notification on my phone. And guys, look. What? Hurricane ch 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 Oh my god, it's not funny. <laughs> What I meant to say was Hurricane Katrina, more like Hurricane Tortilla. Anyways, let's get into the next part of this video. Just like that, wig one has been installed and this is her in all of her glory. Let's get into wig two. Okay, so it is currently 10.49. Mind you guys, I started recording about three o'clock in the afternoon and it's 10.49. And I'm about to get into the second wig. So if my energy is a little bit lower, cut me some slack. Let's go ahead and take it out of the packaging. Ooh. Ooh. Look at the detailing on this hair. Oh. Okay. This has some weight to it. My hand's getting tired and I'm just holding it. Let's prep this wig the same as we did the other one. Some foundation on the inside of the lace. We'll go from there. It's not actual tracks, it's net throughout the whole thing. That's really new. On the front, it's actually this kind of lace. Okay, so this is what the inside is looking like now. Let's try it on. Honestly, that's pretty cool. We I remember thinking, I'm about to beat this bitch up. Yo, these are so cute. And these are super crisp. Look at how neat these locks are. I just went to go show my mom and she said that the back, the back, look and tell me, let me know. What? This is the back. When I showed her, I put my hair to the side like this and I just showed her the back. Part of it in the middle, part of it down the side. You, you can't really do that. But she's cute in the front. So I'm going to add a voiceover from when I am more up and walk you guys through my steps. Psych, I lied. I'm actually not going to be walking you guys through my steps because I'm just replicating what I did in the first half of the video with this wig. The only thing that I did differently is do my edges. So yeah, I'll show you all the clips, but I'm not doing much talking. I've been all in my phone, I got options And I don't wanna tell you to drop me But I don't wanna play your fair Yeah, something That makes me look at you too often oh, Baby, you can give for something Baby, I can run all the time Baby, I'm talking crazy Here's where I did my edges and we'll be back with the final look in three, two. One. In spirit of being dolled up with absolutely nowhere to go, we're gonna start off by adding sugar, spice, and everything nice. Charm. Now that we're done putting the charms in, we're gonna take our new locks by Bobby Boss and crochet them into the It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. So we're not actually going to be using a dreadlock crochet hook. We're going to be using a regular crochet hook. They are significantly different, which I did not realize. And we're just going to be using the crochet hook to hook the hair into the netting on the back of this wig. To make things easier, I would pinch the netting and push the crochet hook through with the new lock and secure it. Which, as you can see here, was a difficult process with the dreadlock hook because it kept getting stuck in the netting. Anyways, class, we learned a very important lesson today, which is live, laugh, love, and persevere because this look turned out divine. Here's a couple styles for you guys. And with that, we are just about at the end of this video. I'll see you all next time. Hugs, love, kisses, and farewell. Somebody come, protect my energy from your past. Don't say, I be my healer, everything I desire. I couldn't see my everything, flow like a river.